Yesterday, the city of Lexington filed a lawsuit against two car manufacturers after several people living in Fayette County found themselves the victim of auto theft simply because of the make of their car. WKYT's Carly Hogston spoke to Mayor Linda Gorton and about how Hyundai and Kia's lack of anti-theft technology affects Lexington. That is our top story at 5. To prevent theft, most people just have to lock their car. But for Hyundai and Kia owners, that's not enough anymore. So that's why the city of Lexington is taking legal action to address this issue. Both Kia and Hyundai have not put in the anti-theft mechanisms that prevent people from starting the car without the key or the fob. And this technology has been available for decades. A technology that is implemented by most car companies. But Lexington Mayor Linda Gorton says these automakers haven't in most of their vehicles, and it shows. According to Mayor Gorton, 40% of the stolen cars this past winter and spring in Lexington were Hyundai's and Kia's, which not only affects the owner of the car, but the city. Our police officers are ending up spending a lot of time just on those two types of automobiles. It takes police officers off of other things and uh, other jobs that they might need to be doing. Mayor Gorton says these thefts could have been prevented. Kristen Sims experienced it firsthand in 2023 when her son's Hyundai Sonata got stolen. It's really a crime and I think they should be sued and I think they should pay for for the fact that it's cost the city, the people, thousands, maybe more. Sims says that the theft brought along insurance troubles and security concerns and even made her son miss days of school and work. I think it could absolutely make a difference and I think you hit Hyundai in the in the pockets and, and maybe then they'll realize what a what a silly thing to do by leaving one small part out that have cost everybody so much money. In Lexington, Carly Hogsman, WKYT.